big tree S42B problem. Take one. Hi, this is Tim, and this is a video to show the problem I'm having with the closed loop stepper system. Okay, so um, here you can see my bench supply. So this is currently set up to supply 13.2 uh, volts, and this is an Arduino Mega. Now um, we have the power supply set up with 5 volts and ground and the yellow wire here is V in so that's supplying the 13.2 volts through to the motor and over here we have enable step direction okay so the red wire here is the enable and I'll, that'll be important in a minute and so if I power this up on the Arduino I have some test software which is just going to run the stepper motor in one direction for a few seconds decelerate reverse run in that direction decelerate reverse and just keep doing that backwards and forwards and um, I know this software works because if you look over the back here um, that my system I'm working on is running the same software and that's been stepping those motors fine for several months so it's good software it's known good software so power on okay and right Immediately there you can see one of the problems, that's the display corruption. And now the display has gone off altogether. The motor is stepping. Um, if we look at the other end, you can see the output shaft going around. Oh, and there it's freaked out. That's one of the other problems. So there is the motor stepping intentionally as designed. And that's about... Uh, 200 rpm something like that and so on the back here as you can see we now have no display okay so let me turn the power off we'll put it back on again there it is booting up and now it's working perfectly normally and we're getting the rpm readout the error which is about 0.2 something like that peaking at 0.5 and the number of degrees on the bottom is changing as you would expect. There it goes freaking out. You can see the red light flashing. It's When it does that, it steps at 600 RPM. Even though the error is close to zero, it shouldn't be doing that. I don't know why it's doing that. And um, so there's the problem. Okay, so now if I just um, remove the enable pin here from the Arduino, uh, let me turn the power off and then I'll remove the enable pin okay and then I'll turn it back on okay and now as you might expect it's not stepping because there's no enable signal okay so <coughs> excuse me what I should be able to do now at this point is to get into the menu and run the calibration okay so if I press K2 here Okay, there I am in the menu mode. All right, but I cannot move the cursor down to any of the other menus and I cannot enter the calibration menu. Okay, so I can, o I can only come in and out of the calibration screen and I can press the reset button and that works. Okay, but uh, these two buttons, K1 and K3, do not seem to work at all. So pretty much those are my problems i would look forward to hearing any suggestions you might have